trying to show them a little bit of my collection right here. This is only like one part of my uh, collection, which is actually in my living room. It's just like a little corner in my living room. Uh, I do have like most of my stuff in like bins and boxes inside that closet. Or some of these bins down here too. But I just kind of want to show like a little bit of what I like to collect and what I've been buying, I guess in the past, maybe a few years that I've been kind of going hard and collecting. A lot of Hot Wheels and a lot of action figures. I wanted to do this video because I um, actually hit the 1,000 subscribers, which is pretty unreal for me because I remember when I started doing these videos, I didn't really expect to have more than a couple hundred subscribers, which is pretty awesome. And I want to thank everybody that has subscribed to my channel. It's mainly just all toys and yeah, pretty much just toys. I did start with like doing a lot of like movies and which I do also have a lot of movies, which I'll show right now in a little bit. I'm just trying to do like a little overview of some of the stuff that I do like. I've been collecting a lot of these like classified G.I. Joes and multiverse DC McFarlane toys. I think I had shown this G.I. Joe. But I do keep a lot of stuff in boxes, carded. And um, so I just pretty much just put them in bins. I don't want to open a lot of my stuff. Some of the stuff that I do open, I, I do have right here. Like some of these figures and smaller toys. A lot of like those surprise little vinyl toys too. I even have some Funko Pops. You know that back right there? That's actually all music CDs. I have like a little, little stack of CDs from like back in the day that I have been collecting. Uh, they're actually been going up in value a lot. So yes, music CDs are, especially from like the 90s and early 2000s, um, have really been going up in value. So it's pretty much something to look forward to if you're into... Uh, Maybe in reselling or just collecting. I do collect, uh, it's mainly like a lot of like Black Sabbath CDs and like Led Zeppelin. They have the Doors. And a lot of like punk bands too that I, I do like. It's like a lot of different styles of music. But I, I do have a lot of, um, apparently I have a lot of Funko Pops too. I have those Fried Kids, little two pack. Some E.T. With the, with the blue robe and the telephone. Just a bunch of like random stuff like this little Batman bobblehead. And there's actually a Sonic figure, which I got not, I got not too long ago. A bunch of Batmobiles and this is all like Batman stuff right here actually. And it's just this bin. And I think this is all like Hot Wheels stuff. I'm not even, I'm not even sure right now. I'm actually... Starting to become a little bit of a hoarder. But yeah, it's mainly because I don't have a like my own collection room or toy room. So yeah, I kind of have to have like some of my stuff a little bit more organized or like in just like a li limited space. So it's so a lot of my figures, mainly a lot of Batman and Jokers and a couple GI Joes classified. Have that Luigi figure. Clip of those Universal Monsters, the creature from the Black Lagoon, and Frankenstein. It's actually a Frankenstein poster from uh, Universal Studios. It's pretty cool. And uh, these are um, my uh, Burger King toys, Universal Monsters. They're from like 1997. I got the Wolfman, and I got Frankenstein, the creature. And my Dracula, I have it in uh, my little Dracula collection or my display case. I'll show that right now. Just a bunch of like random stuff. King Kong and Godzilla. I got a Rugrats Hot Wheels back there. And I do have a lot of these uh, NECA, NECA figures and boxes. Which uh, I have in uh, plastic bins. Just to kind of like keep them like dust free and clean and i really do like those um 
those boxes they display really well like the the box art and everything some evil dead some jason back there but yeah these um these burger king toys are actually pretty expensive right now so something to, like look forward to especially with like the whole like complete i do have all of them with like their stickers and all the stuff they come with i got this uh batman coin bank at the swap meet like 1990 or 1992 i think little tony hawk skateboard some random figures got super mario got iggy it's one of bowser's kids a couple godzillas right there ninja turtle stuff i do have a lot of like vintage turtles too and i think they're in like a box down there somewhere i'll show some of these bins right now yeah, it's just kind of like a little overview of the stuff that I have. Like Toonie Terrors, that Hulk. And like a Pez and stuff, just like random stuff. I like to have just like, I don't really like collect like certain lines. I kind of just like to get random stuff and put it all together. I even have a, some shoes over here. Some bands, some Thrasher bands, which are brand new. I was actually gonna wear those, but um, I said just keep them, keep them new, keep them in the box. So I bought like a little shoe box for those, and I have some like these are some of the Ninja Turtle reissues, the storage shell ones. Actually, I just recently bought these. Like, I got the Leonardo, I got the Donatello, and the Michelangelo. And I already had that Raphael, so now I have all four of those. Those are pretty cool. Got the Mighty Max that I bought the other day at the TC's Rocket Star. Have a Good Burger 25th Anniversary DVD. It's actually a steelbook, which I recently got at the Walmart. Some random stuff right there. I like this vintage watch. Just I like just like to collect a lot of like random stuff, just like old stuff new stuff keep it clean keep it uh, the boxes and stuff and these are all my hot wheels and matchbox that um my loose ones these are all like little six car cases that i got at the dollar tree and this whole this whole row is actually two so there's two stacks like that a couple of jurassic park eggs and stuff some of the newer ones that I got. I actually made a short for those. And um yeah, I do have like, a lot of random stuff. I've been, I've been collecting for like years, so that's something that I just kind of got into. I've actually been into like for a while now. Got a lot of Hot Wheels though. It's my plushies over here. And I do have a lot of my stuff in this closet, so but it's on like in bins and boxes, so maybe I'll, if I start cleaning out, I'll probably show some of those stuff later on. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna show my display case and probably my closet too. I have a lot of my movies and Predator alien stuff. It's just, this is all just like carded Hot Wheels. This is all like full sets too. Like this is the first Retro Racers set. This is actually a treasure hunt. It's all like the garage, I think garage days or something like that. Set of 10. The Camaro set. And I have the Corvette set back there. This is a Colossus figure. In the Marvel Universe. Just random stuff. But yeah, let me just show some of my Stuff that I have in the bins right here. And the displays is all my final faction. These are all Dollar Tree toys. But I think they're actually pretty cool though. Pretty nice. Solid little pieces. And they're only a dollar, so. Some of these have like extra parts and stuff. It's actually pretty sick. And final faction is actually a like a little toy line from the Dollar Tree, so 
made their own little figures. They almost look like little G.I. Joes or just like little monsters. This color is actually pretty nice. And this is my other little bin of Tech Techs, which is, um, there's actually like two rows to like two stacks like that. Just full of Tech Techs. Some are already like complete. And some are just like the boards with like no grip tip or anything. Just put them all together in the bin. These are my vintage uh, McDonald's toys. These are all from the old Happy Meals from like the 90s. I think even some from like the late 80s. The Hamburglar is actually my favorite character. And there's like a lot of Ronald McDonald, just like different themes and some of these I got at the swap me, some of them I bought them online. It's like a lot of random ones. But yeah, it's just like my little little collection of um McDonald's toys. Actually, my favorite one, Darkwing Duck. It's actually a pretty good find, and it's pretty big too. And a lot of like the clown spies, some of the like Yogi Bear ones. Like a lot of different random ones. These are like Dr. Seuss ones. And yeah, just like a lot of different ones. Some of these like bombshell DC, DC girls. Got Marvin the Martian. That was actually one of my favorite characters growing up. I just collect everything Marvin the Martian back in the day. It's just like a lot of like a random stuff, and these are all different vinyl figures. It's all like filled to the bottom my Hot Wheels display case, the 50th anniversary one. Only came with that um, 83 Silverado, blue. And just some like random Hot Wheels that I have. A lot of the, maybe more like the premiums right here. Some of the cars that I like, I like to collect. The Subaru, I like those old vans. Got the party van, that pizza van, the Ninja Turtles. This is actually a Toys R Us exclusive from back in the 90s. And I'm actually missing a car here, I don't even know which one it is, but um, I'll check that later. Some of the Datsuns, 50th anniversary ones. And I have some, a few monster trucks up here, like that El Toro Loco. Here I have my Universal Studios, that banner, and some pins right there. My glass display case. I only have one, it's in the room, so some of the stuff that I have on top. Got my big boy, that Jurassic Park dinosaur. And some of these like 118 scale Fast and the Furious cars. Just like random stuff up there, some movies too. I should really clean that up. But uh, this is my this is my display case with some of the stuff that I really do like. I like stuff that I got in Mexico City. Like the Aztec calendar. Got that Ramco Phantom of the Opera. Star Trek Raphael Ninja Turtles. Some Luchello Wrestlers, Batman. These are some of my Thundercats. Got Bulcher Man, Jacko Man. It's actually a Jacko Man bootleg. Got Lionel, Mumra. 
And that's my Super 7 Thundercats Slythe. And this is the LJN Vintage Slythe. A lot of the... Got some of those Mexico Pepsi promotionals and stuff, like Speedy Gonzalez stuff. And this is actually my Dracula little section right here. The comic book. I have the... That's one of the Burger King toys, the Dracula one. It's in this little, like, little casket. And these are more of my just random figures, like horror figures, NECA figures, fuck Farland toys. I have that, that uh, FBI, Fox Mulder, some wrestlers, and old McFarlane. I even have like a the black black suit Power Ranger back there. That's my mummy poster from Universal Studios also. It's like a lot of random figures. I actually just got this figure the other day. It was just like something that I liked. It was five bucks. It was something that I liked. I don't even know where it was from, but uh, it's actually from the Wildcats, that Jim Lee line. It's pretty cool. Just like a predator back there, just random stuff. Baraka, Captain Spaulding, Terminator 2, Spyro, this Hellraiser. And this is all my Rick and Morty stuff. A lot of Funko Pops, DVDs, little figures, mystery figures, action figures. Just like a lot of everything Rick and Morty, I just kind of just threw it in here. And all the way at the bottom, I just have like a lot of my, like like the Native American stuff. I got that little bozo the clown, the thrift store, some graffiti books, just like random stuff. And some spray cans back there too. Yeah, this is just my display case. The only display case that I have, so this is the one that this is probably like the section that I like the most. One that I'm trying to like fill up right now with like stuff that I like. And I'm trying to get more of those Thundercats. And more of the Ninja Turtle carded figures and oh, even these Remco ones. I was actually missing the cape, so it's pretty much just the figure. But yeah, it's just like a lot of random stuff in here. And these are all my movies. I do have like this shelf where it's like two rows like this. It's like a lot of the stuff that I like. Mainly horror movies. Mad Max action movies. Just a lot of different stuff. Some of these that are like on display like this are just like some of my favorite movies. Like Life, Hateful Eight. The Piranha one. It was mainly like the cover. First Bueller's Day Off. It's like a lot of horror movies. There's a bunch of like random die casts that I kind of just threw in here. A lot of like these small box ones like Major Ed and Tomica Matchbox. And just like some like small random toys. Everything's just kind of thrown in here, though. And that old, like, Olympic mug from the 1984 Los Angeles Olympics. Some Pez keychains. A lot of, like, my rats. I like collecting rats. Those I get, like, at the dollar store, so... Got that old Jack in a Box bobblehead. And up here is all my, all the way to the top right there. It's all predator, alien stuff. But yeah, it's just probably for another video because it's just like a oh, big collection, kind of. Kind of just thrown in there. Uh, this McDonald's, like little set, I got it for like five bucks at a 
at a swap meet and it's actually worth a lot too. Saw it on eBay for like 80 bucks or something. Like McDonald's. I actually worked at McDonald's when I was like 20 years old. So, um, yeah, it's just, I like collecting McDonald's toys. Mainly for the nostalgia part, I guess. But yeah, these are all just movies, pretty much. A lot of horror movies. I have some masks back down there. Garbage Pill Kid, big vinyl figure. Yeah, these are just movies and movies. And a lot of these movies are actually sealed too, because I don't open them till I watch them. And since I have like a lot of streaming ch channels and stuff, so see like this Hellboy too. I find it on Tubi, so I won't even open my copy. Pretty much until I really feel like watching something and I can't watch it like on TV or something. I'll just open it. But it's pretty much just like a lot of my stuff. A lot of toys, a lot of movies, a lot of magazines and collectibles and action figures, Hot Wheels, a lot of stuff and a lot of bins too, so. I keep uh, my stuff kind of clean. I have Lars Ulrich right there. Yeah, just a lot of, a lot of randomness. Well, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to do like a little collection video. And I know not. I don't have like a lot of my stuff on display, but um, see, so I got more bins and bins. They're mainly all Hot Wheels too. They keep carded and try to keep together. But uh, yeah, I just, just wanted to show um, for uh, my 1,000 subscribers, I guess hitting the 1,000 subscribers is kind of like my little collection video. I like that plankton. I actually had that plankton for like years already. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching and thanks for subscribing. 1,000 subscribers, that's pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, see you guys later. Thank you.